And Andy, I can tell you our next guest is very excited about your snow that's coming in the forecast. And we're talking about getting off the beaten path, right? Going into the backcountry can be tons of fun. That's where Claude Duchesne comes in. Claude is a certified mountain guide with a Cinnaboyne Lodge. Claude, uh, Claude is here this morning uh, kind of chatting about the do's and don'ts and talking about a Cinnaboyne. And this is right in Calgary's backyard. So close to us. Yeah, it is. Where, where I work at the Cinnaboyne Lodge, you... Uh, it's really, you fly from Kenmore, yeah. so we're looking at an hour, 15 minutes to access Kenmore and then fly to the lodge in 15 minute flight. That's it? Yeah, that's and it. And then you're in God's country, so to speak, right? Totally, yeah, <laughs> yeah especially after being in the city for a couple of days, nothing yeah. personal, but yeah, it's gorgeous. <laughs> you're itching to get yeah. back into the mountains, yeah. very cool, very yeah. cool. And Assiniboine, um, I just want to talk about this because I was doing some research uh, for families and whatnot, um, it's kind of very simple to get yourselves out of the city and off the regular ski hills and in the, into the backcountry. Yeah, literally, because we're quite fortunate. You, you can have access to Lodge uh, by helicopter. Yeah. So if you have kids, you want to fly up to the Lodge. And then once you're there, it's, uh, it's really special because you actually disconnect to this modern world. Yeah. No internet for the kids, no texting. Okay. And uh, you will be guided. So we guide the guests. Sometimes the kids and parents, we may ski in different groups. I've taken kids ice fishing sometimes. Nice. And the parents may want to relax by the fireplace. Nice. Or generally, the kids will keep skiing a little longer than the parents. At the, end of the, <laughs> the day. parents run out of gas <laughs> yeah, first. Right. Yeah, 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 no kidding, right? No kidding. Um, gear wise, uh, if, if I was to take my family, I'm responsible for renting gear. And, and you've brought in an example of, yeah. of your stuff. So, what would I be looking to get? Well, the gear has changed a lot over the year, and yeah. that's one of the reasons why ski touring has become so popular. The gear is super light now. Yeah. It, in the past, the gear was heavy and clumsy, and it really limit to who could actually access the backcountry. Mm -hmm. And so you want to get some uh, what we call alpine touring gear. Yeah, okay. So it's basically the same ski as you would ski if you go to Sunshine. Sure, sure. On a part of day, but the binding is really what's different. Okay. So the binding is, uh, will let you go up uphill and move the boots okay but when it's time to go downhill you can lock the boots down you lock it in and you can ski that's like regular right. skiing, yeah. but you can release the heel that's so you correct. can cross country ski essentially that's right yeah okay and you also put to go uphill you put a skin under your your ski yeah so it's thick there's glue to it so yeah. you use it to go to the top or and it gives you some traction right that's correct yeah and yeah. when it's time to go down you remove the skin lock the heels Lock the boots to yeah. be in the downhill position, and off you go and then you into the on-track snow. Yeah, <laughs> there you go. Okay, so how's the snow conditions with you guys this year? Well, it has. It was really good earlier in the season, yeah. and then this warm front came. Sure. But now the snow is coming, and the good thing is, is a very good, uh, firm base. Cool. And the new snow will be sitting on top of it, and um, being guided. It's also, especially if you come with your family, you probably don't want to make a decision as well, can I ski this slope or not? Sure, sure. So it's really important to go and be guided, follow also, a guide. Also with the risk of avalanche too. Exactly, yeah, with a yeah. guide, uh, you know, yeah. yourself or whomever it happens to yeah. be knows where's safe and what's not, right? Yeah, that's yeah. correct, yeah. yeah. The idea is to go have fun, but safety always comes first. Of course. Yeah, of course. Okay, and if people want to find out about Assiniboine, how do they do that? Is there a website oh, yeah, they can check out? Yeah, it's just AssiniboineLodge.com. Dot yeah. com, okay, yeah. and we'll put links on our website, breakfasttelevision.ca. Claude, thank Great. you so thank much you for coming much. in. I hope we see you there this yeah, winter. Yeah, good to see cool. you.